What is up, my peeps? Joshua Smith here at GSD Studios. First off, I want to thank you for watching the show. I truly appreciate your support. I know it's annoying, but please listen to the entire intro before the podcast begins as I really need your help. So before we jump in, just a, a few quick favors, you guys. Number one, please share the show with anyone you feel that will benefit. This truly helps grow the show and has a massive impact on many lives. So please go out there, share the show. Sharing is caring, right? Number two, if you've not already, make sure that you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Please leave a five-star review on iTunes and in Stitcher, again, if you have not done so already. Number three, make sure that you join the private GSD Mode Facebook Mastermind group. If you go to www.gsdmode.com, you'll see a link, a button right there on the home page that you can click and uh, request to be added to that group right away. And lastly, I want to give our sponsors a quick shout out that make this show entirely possible. Our first sponsor is my personal 90 day mastery bootcamp. This is my personal mentorship training program where I give you everything that I do inside my business. You get my entire playbook, you guys. We have 12 live three plus hour long sessions. Um, each session we go so in depth on exactly what I do inside my inside my real estate team um, and how I operate my business. Plus there's a lot of different bonus sessions. You get access to everything I do inside my business on my tracking forms, presentations, checklists, lead generation tactics, lead follow-up tactics, team contracts, and much more. There's absolutely nothing that I withhold from you that you don't get access to. Plus you get daily access to me inside the group. So this is hands down the most effective and affordable real estate training program on the planet. Check us out, www.90daymastery.com or click the link below to learn more about that. If you do join, make sure to plug in promo code live mastery. That's all caps, all one word, all together, which will get, save you 500 bucks. Uh, make the whole entire program only like $997 or three payments of 333. Our next sponsor, sponsor number two is perfectstormnow.com. This is an insanely effective lead generation website for realtors and now offers not just the front end website, but a website and CRM combo with all my personal written follow up drips and scripts. And some of these, you guys go out a thousand plus days um, we made it where it's 100% dummy proof uh, and this system you guys competes with a thousand dollar plus month systems that exist in the industry and it's only $199 per month so make sure to check us out www.perfectstormnow.com where you can check out in-depth demos client testimonials more info all that fun stuff um, our third sponsor is EMF I'm really excited about this one this is optimized life nutrition's newest uh, supplement newest nootropic um, it's the by far the most uh, 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 powerful nootropic on the planet. EMF stands for energy memory focus. If you're like me and you want to have insane energy, improved memory, extreme intense focused, um, this is the best product you guys that money can buy. I take it every single day and the results are insane. Improved energy, improved focus, improved mood, awareness, and we've even had many clients tell us improved sex, dude. So it's just this crazy, insane, overall life enhancing uh, uh, product. So check it, check that out at www.optimizelifenutrition.com. Lastly, if you want to be like me and the crew here at GSD Studios, kicking ass every single day, highly recommend that you rock your GSD gear here on the website, www.gsdmode.com. Snag your shirts. We have women's shirts, men's shirts. I uh, got some hats. We got a lot more uh, apparel on the way. So um, that's all I got for you guys. Hope you enjoy the show and uh, we will talk to you soon. What's up, my peeps? Joshua Smith here with another episode of Leveling Up. This is Leveling Episode number two of 2017. Check out that GSD mode hat. You like that shit? Like that TGSD shirt? They're available on the website. The hat's coming soon. We finally found somebody that's epic to go out there and spit out the hats. Shirts are available right now. Shirts are guaranteed to help you level up and kick ass in life tenfold, dude. No, just playing on that, but they are pretty badass. Um, so anyway, you guys, I uh, wanted to uh, create a leveling up episode today. Let me put down my coffee. It's that mid-afternoon, man. Been up for, uh, uh, shit, what I get up? It's been, uh, it's what, 3.30 right now? So I've been up about 12 hours already. Um, so got to get that mid-afternoon pick-me-up, right? So anyway, episode number two, I wanted to talk to you guys about um, two things. Right, just two things that you can do inside your day, inside your life to continue leveling up, to continue kicking ass, to continue uh, uh, taking your life to the next level. That's what these leveling up episodes are all about, right? I don't care 
what level you're at in your life. I don't care whether you you're, have a, a net worth of a penny. I don't care if you have a, a, ne a negative net worth of negative half a million or if you have a net worth of a billion, right? Um, you know, life is all about leveling up. In life, we're either growing or we're dying. There's no such thing as stability. The second you, you reach stability or, or you get to a point where you're, you're, you're seeking stability or maintenance, let's just call it maintenance, Right? Like maintenance is a scary ass place to be. The second you hit maintenance is the second you start to decay. There is no middle ground. You're either growing or you're decaying. The second, like as you're, if, you're, if you're growing, uh, the second you stop growing and thinking that you're, you're just maintenance mode, boom, that's the second you stop to start decaying, right? So this is all about leveling up in life um, and every aspect of our life that's important to us. Uh, the way I define success in life, and again, you guys know this, you've been watching the show for a while, but it's operating at your full potential to what's important to you in this world. You know, who the hell am I to tell anybody what success should be for their life, right? It doesn't, doesn't matter how you define it. It's however you want to define it. Just every single day, work on getting a little bit better, growing a little bit, um, not decaying, not going negative, but always growing, uh, getting a little bit better, leveling up each and every day uh, to get that much closer to your full potential at whatever you're trying to achieve in this life. So um, every single year, uh, at the end of the year, I do some deep reflection. Right, so I do deep reflection every single day, as you're going to hear about here in a minute. Um, but at the end of the year, um, I really do some deep reflection. You know, right? I really want to go deep in, you know, what what happened in the last year. Um, you know, what what what? Are, and I want to break things down to the most simplistic fashion. Like I, I'm a simple-minded dude. Um, complicated things, dude. I, I'm just not smart enough to be able to handle complication, you know, right? It confuses me. I find the more complicated shit is, the less I take action, the less, you know, I'm able to go out there and execute on it. So I got to break things down to a very simplistic fashion. It's like divide and conquer, right? I want to break things down to the most simplistic fashion that I possibly can. Um, so I'm only dealing like with one or two things. Um, and then I'm just going to focus on those, right? I don't want to have a laundry list of all this bullshit that I got to take care of and do. Um, Cause I know for me, I'm just gonna just gonna not take the action I need to take. So when I'm reflecting on 2017, um, and it was a good year, dude. <laughs> you know, right? I mean, it was it was speaking of business. Um, it was the best year that I've ever had in business, right? From all of my businesses, dude. From my software business, Perfect Storm, to my real estate business, to the boot camp business. Um, every single business we launched, our, our, our supplement company. Um, if you look at my overall net worth, I mean, it was a freaking dope ass business year. There was, there was a couple elements in my life that, that I leveled down on, which I'll talk to you guys about and be honest with you in 2017 and let you know my journey of those. And that, that happened within my um, reflection awareness, you know, cause sometimes we live in these extremes, right? You're out there pounding so hard over here. You can neglect what's important over here. And it happens to all of us. I know I'm on this, this camera always preaching about leveling up and pay attention to everything that's important to you. Look, the reality is you guys, it's way easier for me to spit this knowledge to you into this camera than it is to, to execute on this stuff. I struggle with this shit every single day too, right? I'm struggling every single day. The reality is though, I just struggle a little bit less than I used to. And, that, and that's my plan, dude. Every day, just, man, just get a little bit better, struggle a little bit less, right? Uh, um, become a little bit more wise, uh, a little bit sharper, um, a little bit better at what I'm doing out there. But I, again, I, I, don't, I don't believe in this whole thing of, of perfection. Perfection, again, you, know, you hear me say this all the time, it's just a hologram um, with that. So anyway though, as I'm dialing in my reflection, dude, I realized that there's only two things, right? If I do these two things and if I learn to execute on these two things on a more consistent level and do these better, um, I'm gonna go out there and double my businesses in 2017. And not just my businesses, but other things that I wanna level up on in life. And those two things, and, and so far, as of right now, we're, we're like February, as I'm making this, this video, we're uh, two or three weeks into February, right? So we're already on track to double almost everything um, inside my business world that we did in 2016, right? So we're right there, our goals are there, man, we're hammering this stuff, I'm paying more attention every single day, the daily numbers, daily action than I ever have, I'm more focused than I've ever been. Um, and it was really just these two things that I learned to really dial in on. Um, and those two things are my morning routine, in my evening routine, right? I just found as simplistic as it is, um, is just those two things. 
you know, right? Like sometimes we're looking for the magic pill, dude. Like what's that magic pill, that magic new marketing tactic, that magical new, you know, I don't know, uh, lead gen tactic, system, whatever it may be that, that's gonna, or the new diet or whatever, whatever is gonna be that's gonna take us to the next level. And I realized, nope, dude, it's just my, my morning routine and my evening routine. Now I'm always trying to dial these in, but the reality is in 2016, you know, I was probably like 80%, right? Probably 80% of the time, and it wasn't something I actually tracked a percentage on, that's, that's my best guess. It's about 80% of the time I hit my routines, the other 20% of the time I didn't. So 2017, I'm like, dude, I'm gonna hit this shit every single day, right? I'm gonna go out there, I'm gonna commit to hitting it every single day, I don't care what, what happens, what the situation is, where I'm at, what the circumstance is, I'm hitting these two things every single day because I've realized the importance of these. So let me walk you through these really quickly. Um, so my morning routine, right? When I get up, and this, this is very simplistic, I'm not talking about you know, some hardcore workout routine and meditation routine, even that's part of it. I have a morning routine that I go through, that, that I do some self-development in, that I meditate in, uh, um, that I do some reflection in, um, but I have a document. And I share this document with all of my consulting and coaching clients. We'll probably be making it into uh, um, like a daily performance journal at some point here for the GSD Mode uh, a website and GSD Mode listeners. But inside this document, you guys, and I end up, it's a two-part document. So it's, it's partly for the morning and it's partly for the evening, right? So the first thing is planning out my perfect day. So step number one for the morning is I'm going to plan out my perfect day. And in the evening, I'm reflecting on how I did. Okay, here's what you had to do to kick today's ass to win today, to get one step closer to your goals, dreams, and visions. How did you do? Right? So when I'm filling this out in the morning, now I actually prefer to fill it out the night before, before I go to bed. It helps me sleep better at night. But then the first thing I, I do when I get up in the morning is I review it. So on there, I put in uh, my 2000 17 or whatever the year is this year, my, my goals, my business goals or my overall goals for that year, right? So I'm writing, okay, what's, what's my 2017, let's say income goal. And then underneath that, what's my year to date income goal? So every single day I'm looking at what my income goal is, what my year to date income goal is. And then below that, I list all my GSD mode outcomes. Those of you that have been following the show, you know what those are, right? What are the outcomes, the number one outcome, the number one priority um, that is crucial to me in every aspect of my life that's important to me. So what's my number one business outcome? What's my number one outcome with my health? What's my number one outcome with my wife? Number one outcome with my family or my kids, right? So I list that every single day on there. Then below there, I always calculate how many months I have left on this planet. If I'm blessed to live the average age of the average human being at 84 years old, when I prorate, uh, do the math and I prorate it, how many months do I have left? As I've created this, this uh, 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 podcast, episode, whatever the hell you call these leveling ups, not really sure what uh, the technical term for this shit is, um, uh, but I have 584 months. If I'm blessed with the average uh, human being, I have 584 months left on this planet. Then below that, I have my 10 gratitudes. What are my 10 daily gratitudes that I'm grateful for? Because uh, uh, is, is hardcore striving entrepreneurs, we are hardcore drivers, dude, it's so easy to get so caught up and never being satisfied, always wanting more, that it's very easy to step away from um, the things that we're, we're grateful for, right? And then you just become miserable. So I find every single day, if I just bust out 10 things that I'm grateful for, uh, um, it forces me to get into a state where I am grateful, I am blessed, right? Now I'm never satisfied, right? I wanna to get to the next level, I'm pissed off that I'm not where I know I should be, but I also then learn to be grateful and blessed um, and honor the things that I have. So I go through those, right? So then from there, I'm looking at all the, the, the top three, so below that's the top three uh, uh, biggest things that must happen today to make today a win, right? Then from there, I go to my to-do list and then legion activities and all these different activities that I gotta do for today to make today a win. And then inside there's my calendar, right? And I break down my 24-hour calendar in 15-minute segments because I'm always trying to squeeze in as much time as I possibly can. If my time is worth X dollars per minute, I wanna condense that time as much as I possibly can. So I do this shit in 15-minute segments, man. How, how, how much can I get done in 15 minutes, I'm just trying to squeeze this out. So I hand write out my calendar, even though it's also in Google calendars, every single day forces me, then I got my Google calendar up, and then I'm handwriting this, so it forces me to really, really focus on my daily schedule, my daily routine, my daily appointments. Um, so th so I have that, right? So that that's, that is part number one of what must happen for me to win the day. And on there too, you know, there's a bunch of other fields for what must happen for my workout, meditation, family time, um, all that stuff, right? So, so I don't believe in this work-life balance. It's all life, so I'm just gonna integrate it all, right? I'm just gonna bring it all together, integrate it all. I wanna win the day in every aspect of my life. So here's what I must do to win the day. 
So I do it the night before I go to bed. First thing I do, I wake up in the morning, I review it all. My outcomes, my goals, my to-do list, my calendar, my schedule, the three most important key indicators that I must do in my business um, to make this a win. Like this is what I must do to move this needle forward to dominate today. Because right? I know we say this all the time, you guys, but if you want to go out there and kick 2017's ass, right? What do you got to do? Well, you got to win enough months. In order to win the year, you got to win enough months. In order to win enough uh, 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 months, you got to win enough weeks. And in order to win enough weeks, you got to win enough days. So all it boils down to every single day is me being laser focused on kicking every day's ass. Now, there's days that I lose the day, you know, right? That I don't win the day. I'm not perfect. Um, and that's where the second part comes in. I mean, I'm trying to go out there and dominate every single day and stay uber focused on this stuff every single day. Now, step number two is at the end of my working day, Right, I take out that document and now I'm reflecting on it. Okay, here, here, here's what I had to do to create success. What did I do? What did I get done? And sometimes I dominate it, sometimes I do more, right? Sometimes I fall short, life gets in the way, shit happens. Maybe some meetings went way long, some, some you know, issues came up that I wasn't anticipating. That's life, right? So sometimes I, I, I dominate it, sometimes I just hit it, sometimes I fall short. So here's everything that I, that I had to do today. How did I execute? How did I do? And then what's the reality of what got done? And then in there, I'm also asking myself, right, based on what I did today, um, what can I do after, after going through this and learning and reflecting, what can I do tomorrow to improve and get better? You know, right? And then from there, now that I've reflected, I've looked at this, I'm, I'm, I'm able to go out there and see anything that's on my calendar that needs to be eliminated, anything I can be more effective and efficient on, right? So I'm planning then I'm executing and now I'm reflecting hard. And then as soon as I get done with that reflection, then boom, guess what? Now I'm planning out the next day. So it's really just those, those things, right? So obviously in life, we gotta go out there and execute. Now, that's what we're doing all day long. Like you are executing right now, right? You're just walking, you're eating, you're breathing, you're talking, you're watching this, this show, this episode here. We're executing all day long. Right now, I want to execute intentionally with the game plan. I don't want to execute in a lackadaisical fashion. I'm not here to just exist, right? I, I want to go out there and dominate and create the most epic life I possibly can and kick some ass while I'm doing it. I want to enjoy life. I want to create a big, amazing life, right? So I'm going to go out there and plan my day intentionally so I can execute at the best uh, level I possibly can with an intentional game plan. Then I'm going to execute my ass off and I always keep this with me. Dude, this is like a six page document. I keep it with me all day long. Why? Because I veer off. Man, it's, it, it, it's like, you know, shit's going good. You know, I, always, I always sit there and say like, I got insane, amazing, epic willpower until like noon. And then it's just out the damn window, right? So then at that point, I can't rely on willpower anymore. I mean, I'm, I'm so freaking strong and disciplined and hardcore in the morning. And then at noon, dude, it's all gone for me. You know, right? So no longer can I rely on willpower or discipline and strength. Now I gotta rely on what's in front of my eyeballs, right? So, so I gotta keep, keep reviewing that. And then if I start having weak moments, oh shit, I better pull this out, better review it, right? To, to kind of veer myself or get myself back on track. It's like an airplane spends, what, 90% of its time in the air adjusting the nose because of turbulence, you know, right? So as turbulence is happening throughout my day, I wanna keep readjusting myself to making sure I execute on the perfect day. And then at the end of the day, after I'm done executing, okay, let me reflect on this. Let me see how I did. Let me see how I can improve. Let me see what what needs to be eliminated so I can make uh, more room for, for more effective things. Let me see how I can be more effective and efficient. And again, how I can go out there and grow and improve and be better tomorrow. And then I'm going to plan out the next perfect day. So every single day, you guys, we're already executing. So the two things, and this is my, my biggest focus, really, dude, my only two like uh, major focuses for 2017, I don't want to focus on more than two things, right? And, and, and that's what I've, out of everything that I've done, um, everything that I do, every business that I operate, those are the two most powerful things that I was able to break all this down to is my planning and then my reflection. So every single day, man, I want to plan, I'm going to execute like a mofo, and then I'm going to plan, um, then I'm going to reflect so I can grow properly, and then I'm going to go out there and plan again, right? So do those two things, you guys. I know this isn't always the fun, sexy stuff when you're out there grinding all day long, plus you got your families, plus you got everything else that you're, you're, you're having to take on. Dude, it's hard. You're mentally exhausted. You're beat up. It's hard to sit there and focus on this stuff. But I promise you, this is the stuff that's going to make the difference, man. This is the stuff that's going to make or break you. This is the stuff that's going to take you to the next level. Take you from may may maybe, you're, maybe you're average. Maybe you're above average, man. But if you want to go to greatness, man, this is the stuff that truly matters. So anyway, you guys, make sure you implement those two things. I know that's my most uh, important focus as I enter 2017. And I will keep you updated. We will see you next time here on Leveling Up. Thanks for watching, you guys.
All right, peeps, that wraps up today's show. Again, thank you so much for watching the show. I truly appreciate just a few quick reminders and favors that I need from you. Number one, please share the show. Anyone you feel can benefit from this show, um, this truly helps us show, grow the show, continue going out there and having impacts on many, many lives. So it'd mean the world to me if you went out there and shared the show. Number two, um, if you haven't done so already, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Also, please go out there on iTunes, Stitcher, leave us a, a five-star positive review. All that stuff helps for awareness of the show. Um, also, make sure to join the GSD Mode private Facebook mastermind group. If you haven't already, you can go to gsdmode.com. Right on the front page, there's a link there. Click that. We'll get you added right away. A lot of cool stuff in there, a lot of masterminds. We're bringing a lot of Facebook Live, different stuff in there. They have access to that you can't get anywhere else. And lastly, I want to give our sponsors a quick shout out that make this show possible. So our first sponsor is my personal 90-day mastery boot camp. This is my personal mentorship training program where I give you everything everything that I do inside my business, right? You get my entire playbook. We have 12 live, three plus hour long training sessions. Um, you get daily access to me inside the program. There's a bunch of bonus training sessions. You get access to every single thing that I do inside my business. All my tracking forms, all my presentations, checklists, lead generation tactics, lead follow-up tactics, team contracts, and so much more, you guys. There's nothing that compares to this program. You get full access to everything that I do inside my company. I hold nothing back. Go check us out, www www.90daymastery.com where you can learn more information, see future dates, see testimonials, all that fun shite. Um, if you decide to join, make sure to plug in live mastery inside the promo code, all one word, all together, all caps. That'll save you 500 bones on the program. So you get it for only $997, which is a freaking steal or three payments of 333 bucks. Our next sponsor is perfectstormnow.com. So perfectstormnow.com is an insanely effective lead generation website for realtors and now offers a website and CRM combo uh, with all my custom personal follow-up drips, um, all of my scripts that are inside there, right? So there's no guesswork. And when a lead comes in, based on the lead source, you're gonna know exactly what to say, when to say, how to say, all of it's just auto-filled, and we made it where it's dummy-proof. I mean, this system is as powerful, if not more powerful, in my opinion, than a $1,000 plus monthly websites, and it's only 199 bucks a month. So go to perfectstormnow.com. You can check out in-depth demos, see more testimonials, learn more information on it, all that, all that uh, cool jazz. Our last sponsor is EMF, so Optimized Life Nutrition has created the most powerful nootropic on the planet called EMF, Energy, Memory, Focus. So if you're like me and you want insane energy, improved memory, um, and extremely intense focus, this is the best product that money can buy, you guys. Um, I personally take it every single day before I do webinars, before I do things like this, man. I'm always taking this product to go out there and enhance, uh, uh, you know, again, my focus, my intensity, my memory, every aspect of it. Um, so go out there and check right now on www.optimizelifenutrition.com where you can learn more about EMF. Uh, lastly, you guys, if you want to be like me and the rest of the GSD crew, um, as well as my real estate team and, and so many others that listen to this, uh, listen to the show and support the show, Make sure you're rocking this GSD mode gear, man. We want to go out there and spread the love, spread the word, spread the GSD mode name. So on the site, gsdmode.com, we have men's shirts, women's shirts. Uh, we're starting to, to, to run a lot new apparel uh, through the site, so you see a lot more coming as well. So make sure to go check out the site, pick that up, have some fun. Thank you again for watching, and we'll see you next time. Peace out.